So I have all these Pokemon blind boxes and remands. Um, we have 10 different sets total. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna open one from each one until they are all gone. So this will be a six part series. Okay, so we have total 11 blind boxes that are Pokemon themed. So we're gonna go ahead and start opening them. We'll just grab the first one here. It looks like you can get a different types. Look, there's a little cluff on a Fampy, some legendaries, and some other Pokemon. I think probably out of this one, this is my favorite one. Let's just go ahead and open. So it comes with gum. This is really old, so we're gonna throw that away. But look, we got Fancy and the Cluffa, and this is the one I just said I really liked. So it comes with a little land thing, and I think the water fills in the rest. Like so? Is there a little... Maybe it just stands there? That is adorable. Okay, so... We got my favorite one of the group. He's falling off. We got this one, um, probably the other one that I'd really want would be the Raikou one, but this one's definitely my favorite one. Let's see if I can get like my favorite one in the first go for each one. Okay, we'll just go down the line. On the box, there's Chikorita, Wooper, Espeon, Ponyta, Ampharos, Pidgeotto, and Suicune. Suicune is one of my favorite Pokemon, so probably I'd want that one. But this one's really cute too, the Chikorita with the Wooper. And this one, everything's bunched up. Okay, we got the Pidgeotto. So we have this tiny little Pikachu, that's so small. And it goes on top of the Pidgeotto. And it just goes like this. And inside the Pokeball goes. Okay, I lied, I really like this. I'm actually happy with that one too. So the next one, we'll just go down this one, and I really like this one. I want this one. There's a Slowpoke, and the Umbreon, Gengar, Totodile, and Maltres, and Gengar and Totodile. The Gengar one looks really cool. The Totodile one is super cute too, but probably still aiming for this one. Totodile one. So I'd say the Totodile one was probably my third choice. Not my first though, because we wanted the Sleeping Marie. Okay, there are a lot of pieces. So the water goes with the rock right here. And then another splash right there. Okay. I mean, it's not perfectly straight, but that's the best I can do. And inside the rock, here's a little flower. Okay, here's the Totodile. 
That was much more annoying to put together than the rest. So there's Charmander, Zapdo, Cyndaquil, Mischievous, Celebi, and Vaporeon. I'm not into any of these too much, but the Charmander is pretty cute and probably the Celebi as well. I think I'll probably aim for Charmander though. That's first choice. And we got Zapdos. Oh, there's tiny little pieces in here. I'm not a big fan of tiny pieces. Okay, so there's little holes inside here to put the thunderbolts in. I'm just going to put them in wherever. Is there an order to it? Well, I hope not because I'm just putting them in like whatever. The one in the middle right here I think goes with the Zapdos. And then lightning just surrounds it. Okay, that was extremely annoying. I hated that. Please do not ever come out of the Pokeball again. Okay, well, we're gonna change it up by opening one of these Pikachu ketchup boxes. And it's just Pikachu and a lot of ketchup, so it's a lot of red and yellow. So ketchup bottle, corn dog, omurice, more omurice, um, some soup, some pizza or toast, a burger, and then it looks like it actually cut the ketchup bottle. So these are the different ones we can get. Oh, and it comes with a cute plate. Okay, so we have the Almerais. Let's let's just do a close up of this plate. Look how that plate looks. It's so detailed. I wonder if all the other ones have different plates. So I'll put on the little ketchup and Pikachu. Next is this Pokemon World Market. And these are all like Pokemon themed items and all stuff that you can, I think actual game items as well. Like there's the Pokedoll um, there's the Pokey Flute, and then I think these are like just like um, base dolls, like the Piplup and the Torchic. There's the Squirtle, like watering can and Moo Moo Milk, the Substitute doll, and there's just a lot of things. So you can get a little Ferris wheel. I want that one a lot. And then looks like you can get Serena's hat, some skates, um, that Toucan Pokemon, it's a roller or a ruler. And then an executor pen and some other stuff. There's a bike with a map. Yeah, in the end, I think I want the Ferris wheel one. Oh, do each of these come with a little poster? That's cool. Okay, so we have a Sinnoh region poster. So we have this little box and I'm pretty sure this chocolate bar goes in there. Maybe. Or maybe it's these two little bun things. Maybe those go in there. And then we have these little drawers and they actually open. 
I'll just put those bun things in here. And then we have a little shovel. And then we have an excavation hat. And a little poster, which I believe is the map of the Sinnoh region. So this is supposed to represent Sinnoh. I wonder if it's like different regions for each box or if it's just all Sinnoh. Oh, and then I forgot. We have a cute little Piplup Poke doll. We might as well open the other Pokemon World box. Oh, the Ferris wheel. We got the Ferris wheel. Nice. And then there's a poster. I can't forget the poster. Okay, so this poster is the Unova region. So it's another um, island map of Unova. And then there is the Ferris wheel. And then right here, there's a little stand for our little hiker dude. And he's all pixelated. And I love the fact that he's pixelated. And it also comes with the substitute doll. And then a little um, ice cream, which is like vanilla themed. Okay. This box is next. Another terrarium box. There is Blossom, Entei, Mew. Wobbuffet, Trico, and Magnemite. I think I like the Magnemite the most, so that's my number one. Trico will probably be my number two. And we got Trico. So we got my number two pick. So big tree goes here. Oh, and this is super pointy. Um, if you ever do have this, be careful assembling it. And Trico lays down just like that. So this is a tropical one. It's um, part of the Alola region. There's Mimikyu. There is Alolan Vulpix. Um, Beware. Rowlet and Pikachu, Litten and Poplio, but I think I like the Poplio. I'm the sleeping Pikachu and Rowlet is super cute too, and Mimikyu. I love Mimikyu as well. So there's just lots of good ones here. This is two pieces. Yep, okay. And some water goes here. See, I like how these have attachments, unlike uh, this one where it's just kind of like form fitting. And there's a little box. Let's just push the box more, and then Litten goes there. And then there's the berry that goes on top. And then carefully, we'll put it in here. And we have our little litten. So, this is a really pretty box. It has a squirtle in the middle, and I want the squirtle. There's a Psyduck and Poliwag, Cubone and Sandshrew, Articuno. Togepi and Pikachu, and then a Charizard as well. Number one is still that Squirtle though. Oh, this has a lot of depth to it. Okay, so we'll tap the water first. Then the coconut tree, 
a sand shrew goes there, and a cubone right here. I think I like all the ones with multiple different Pokemon instead of just the one Pokemon because they have so much like details and so many like stories. And then the final one for today. It's another Alola version. There's Pikachu and that one galaxy-like Pokemon with the moon in the background. I want that one. And... Oh man, I don't know any of these Pokemon names. I know that's a Lola Raichu. Is that Lycan Rock? Um, so I played all the Pokemon games, but I stopped remembering all the names of them. Um, maybe after fourth or fifth generation, because there's there's just too many to remember. And then there's a Sleeping Rowlet, and then another Lolan Ball Picks. I would be happy with any of these three. I don't know how many times I've said it, but not a big fan of these small pieces. So the tree top just goes right in there with a sleeping rowlet. And I don't know if you can tell, let me zoom in. This rowlet is blushing. Look at that, it's so cute. Okay, and then berries surrounding. This is just another one of those that I'll never open again because I don't want to lose those pieces. So these are all the ones that we opened. Um, one of my favorite ones will be this Ferris wheel with the little hiker dude on it. I think it's so tiny and cute. I really like this one here which is the Fampia and Cleffa. I think it's super adorable. And then this one, the Pidgeotto and Pikachu. I think so far these three will be displayed on my shelf. Um, the rest, they'll just go in a nice box. Thank you all for watching and don't forget to check out the next video which will be coming out sometime next week maybe for the second installment. Thank you for watching.